So what is today? Yeah, what happened on Easter? What happened? Yeah, God, Jesus died. Yeah. He came back to life. He died on Friday. We celebrate on Friday. And then today, he came back to life. Well, I'm going to show you something here. The scripture I read. Nobody can see me. With Paul was talking to, he sent a letter to the church. And that some people at that church didn't believe that Jesus rose from the dead. Okay? So that scripture I read, Paul was saying that if Jesus didn't rise, then our faith is useless. Our preaching is useless. So let's say this is Jesus' resurrection. He rose from the dead. That's at the bottom. That's what we build on, right? Okay? And then this would be our faith. Okay. And then this is our salvation because Jesus died and how we be saved. All right? And then this is our eternal stay there. That's that's our eternal hope. That's our hope to go to heaven with Christ, okay? And Jesus Okay, Jesus' resurrection, when he rose from the grave, that made all of this possible. We we have faith and we have salvation. It's not fault. Well, Paul says that if we don't have the resurrection, we have... <laughs> it's useless. It's no good. It comes crumbling down. And that would be so sad because we would have no... We would have no foundation for faith. We would have no salvation. We would have no eternal hope. We would have no glory with God in heaven. But the good news is, Paul later on says in verse 20, he says, but, but Christ did rise from the dead. And so that means that our faith is real. And that means that we do have salvation. And that means that we will stay there. <laughs> that we will spend eternity with Christ and God in heaven when we believe. That is what is awesome, right? No, it's not falling down anymore. Because Jesus rose from the grave and we can build a foundation. That's what we believe. That's what builds up everything. If he didn't die, if he didn't rise, then it means nothing. But he did. He rose from the dead. <laughs> He's dead. He's dead. We don't... You know, there's a song that, 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 that the junior choir sings sometimes. It says, God's not dead. Our God's not dead, right? He is alive. And today we're celebrating that. Can we, can we pray together and thank God for that? Dear God, thank you so much for sending Jesus to send him to die and then he rose again so that we might live with you when we believe in him. Thank you so much, God. We praise you. In Jesus' name, amen.